Welcome to BBC Earth Coins, where we explore the fascinating world of rare coins and numismatics. In this video, we're diving deep into the incredible story of Lincoln pennies that have become worth millions of dollars. We're exploring a rare gem in the world of coins, the 1968 S Mint Mark Lincoln penny. This seemingly ordinary penny has a story that's anything but ordinary. Stick around to discover why this coin is worth millions. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon for more incredible coin stories and valuable insights. Now, let's get into the incredible tale of the 1968 S. Lincoln Penny. The 1968 S. Lincoln Penny was minted in San Francisco and is part of the popular Lincoln series, which started back in 1909. While the Lincoln Penny has been a staple of American currency for over a century, the 1968 S variety is a standout due to its unique history. In 1968, the San Francisco Mint was still producing coins with a S Mint mark, indicating their origin. However, what makes this particular penny so intriguing is a rare error that occurred during its production, a mistake that turned this coin into a collector's dream. Coin enthusiasts and collectors have long been fascinated by errors and rare varieties. For the 1968 S. Lincoln penny, there's a specific error known as the double die obverse variety. This error resulted in a noticeable doubling of the inscriptions on the coin's face, including the liberty and in God we trust. Dot. Collectors and experts eagerly sought out these coins due to their distinctive appearance. The rarity and uniqueness of this error make it a prized possession for those lucky enough to find one. So, why is the 1968 S. Lincoln penny worth millions? The value of these coins has skyrocketed due to their rarity and the demand among collectors. In recent years, well-preserved specimens of the 1968 S double die obverse penny have sold for staggering amounts, reaching well into the millions. One such coin recently fetched an astonishing $2.5 million at auction, proving that a small error can lead to a big payoff. Factors like the condition of the coin, its rarity, and its historical significance all contribute to its high value. The 1968 S. Lincoln penny is a testament to how something as simple as a minor error can transform an everyday coin into a multi-million dollar treasure. If you're a coin collector or just fascinated by rare finds, keep your eyes peeled. You never know what you might discover. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with fellow coin enthusiasts. We're diving deep into the 1964 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny, a coin that's not just a piece of history but could be worth millions of dollars. That's right, this little penny could make you a millionaire. So let's uncover the secrets behind its value, its history, and how you can spot one in your collection. The Lincoln Penny has been around since 1909, but what makes the 1964 No Mint Mark Penny so special? Well, in the early 1960s, the U.S. Mint was under a lot of pressure to produce more coins. The coin shortage of the time had collectors and everyday people hoarding pennies, which led to a spike in production. Most of the 1964 pennies were minted in Philadelphia, which is why you won't see a mint mark on them. But here's the twist. While millions of these pennies were minted, not all 1964 pennies are created equal. Some have unique features that make them stand out and those are the ones collectors are after. Now, the 1964 penny itself isn't rare. Billions were made. However, certain pennies from this year have been found in pristine condition or with specific errors that increase their value. If you have a high-grade 1964 penny with no wear and tear, that's where the big money comes in. Coin collectors and investors are willing to pay top dollar for these flawless examples. For example, a 1964 No Mint Mark penny that's been graded MS67 or higher can sell for thousands of dollars. And if you're lucky enough to find one with a rare minting error, well, now we're talking millions. So, how do you know if you've got one of these valuable 1964 pennies? Here's what to look for. First, check the condition. A penny in mint or near mint condition, without any wear, is much more valuable than one that's been circulated. Next, consider having your penny professionally graded. This can make all the difference when it comes to selling it. And finally, keep an eye out for minting errors. Things like doubling on the lettering, a weak strike, or even an off-center image can dramatically increase the value. 
Let's talk numbers. The highest recorded sale of a 1960 for no mint mark penny in top condition was a staggering dollar ten zero 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 at auction. And some rare error coins from this year have been sold for hundreds of thousands of dollars. It's not far-fetched to think that the right coin could eventually break the million-dollar mark, especially as demand for rare pennies continues to rise. If you think you've got a valuable 1964 penny, it's important to protect it. Store it in a coin holder or a protective case to avoid scratches or wear. And when it's time to sell, always go through a reputable dealer or auction house. This will ensure you get the best price for your rare find. So there you have it. The 1964 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny might just be sitting in your pocket change or an old jar at home, waiting to be discovered. If you've got one, take a closer look. You might be holding on to a small fortune. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss a chance to learn about valuable coins that could change your life. We're diving into a modern-day marvel, the 2060 Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. You might be wondering, a 2006 penny worth millions of dollars? How is that possible? Well, let me tell you, this coin has a story that will blow your mind. So, if you've got some 2006 pennies lying around, you'll want to stick around to find out if you've struck gold. Figuratively, of course. Before we jump into why this penny is worth so much, let's first talk about its history and design. The 2006 Lincoln penny continues the long-standing tradition of the iconic Abraham Lincoln portrait, which first appeared on the penny back in 1909 to celebrate Lincoln's 100th birthday. In 2006, the Denver Mint, hence the D-Mint mark, produced millions of these Lincoln pennies. While most of these pennies went into circulation and are valued at face value, a few rare coins have skyrocketed in value due to unique circumstances. More on that in a moment. Let's talk about the design. The obverse of the 2006 penny features Lincoln's iconic side profile. The reverse showcases the Lincoln Memorial, a design that had been used on the back of the penny since 1959. The D-Mint mark indicates that this coin was struck at the Denver Mint, one of the two main facilities producing U.S. coins. Now, let's get into what makes certain 2060 Lincoln pennies worth a small fortune. It all comes down to rarity and condition. While the majority of these pennies are standard, there are a few rare errors and high-grade coins that are fetching big bucks at auctions. One such variety is known as the Mint State Penny, graded MS-68, or higher by professional grading services. These pennies are pristine, with sharp details and no visible signs of wear or damage. Because they are so difficult to find in this perfect condition, collectors are willing to pay top dollar, sometimes even in the millions. Another reason for high value can be due to minting errors. Some 2060 pennies might have rare errors like double strikes, off-center strikes, or die cracks, which make them incredibly rare and valuable to collectors. Let's talk numbers. In recent years, some 2060 Lincoln pennies in mid-state condition have fetched jaw-dropping prices at auction. We're talking tens of thousands, and in rare cases, even over a million dollars. These high prices are due to the combination of rarity, collector demand, and the flawless condition of the coins. If you think you have a 2060 penny in perfect or near-perfect condition, it could be worth getting it graded by a professional coin service. Who knows? You might be sitting on a fortune without even realizing it. So, how can you tell if you've got one of these valuable pennies? First, look for the D-Mint mark just below the ear. Then, examine the condition. Are there any scratches, dents, or signs of wear? If your penny looks flawless, it might be worth sending it to a professional coin grading service. Also, keep an eye out for any unusual mint errors like doubling or off-center strikes. You'll also want to research recent auction results to see if pennies similar to yours have sold for high prices. This can give you a better idea of the potential value of your coin. And there you have it. The 2060 Mint Mark Lincoln Penny might just be one of the most valuable coins in your collection. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just getting started, always check your change. You never know when you'll come across a hidden treasure. Thanks for watching.
If you enjoyed this video and want to learn more about rare and valuable coins, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel for more awesome content. And let me know in the comments, have you ever found a rare penny in your collection? I'd love to hear your story. We're uncovering the story behind the 1964 D. Mint Mark Lincoln penny. Yes, this ordinary looking penny could be worth millions of dollars. Stick around to find out how and why. So, what makes a simple 1964 D. Mint penny potentially so valuable? Is it an error? A rare variation? Or maybe it's something else entirely? Let's break it down, starting with a bit of history. The 1964 D. Lincoln penny was struck at the Denver Mint, indicated by the D. Mint mark below the date. This penny is part of the Lincoln Memorial series, which replaced the earlier wheat penny design in 1959. The series honors the legacy of President Abraham Lincoln, featuring his iconic profile on the front, or obverse, and the Lincoln Memorial on the back, or reverse. In 1964, the U.S. Mint produced a staggering number of pennies, over 3.8 billion at the Denver Mint alone, so you might think these coins are common and not worth much. But like all collectibles, rarity and condition play a huge role in determining value. So, why is the 1964 D penny worth millions? It all comes down to a few factors, condition, errors, and collector demand. Let's start with condition. Coins are graded on a scale from 1 to 70, with 70 being a flawless, mint condition coin. A perfectly preserved 1964 D penny with an MS67 or higher grade can be worth thousands, or even millions, because of its extreme rarity in such pristine condition. But it's not just about condition. Some rare era coins have surfaced from the 1964D batch, including doubled dies and repunched mint marks. These minting mistakes make certain pennies even more valuable to collectors. We'll show you what to look for when examining your 1964D pennies in just a moment. All right, here's where things get interesting. When you're examining a 1964D penny, there are a few key details to look for. First, check for mint errors like a doubled die, where the design elements appear doubled. Pay close attention to the date and the Liberty inscription. Another valuable error is the repunched mint mark, where you can see a D mint mark that was struck more than once, creating a shadow effect. Of course, a coin in high-grade condition, with very few scratches and strong detail, could also fetch a hefty price at auction. Coins that have been well-preserved in protective holders are especially sought after. Now, let's talk about those jaw-dropping prices. In recent years, high-grade 1964D Lincoln pennies have sold for tens of thousands at auction. And in some rare cases, coins with the perfect combination of grade, error, and rarity have been valued in the millions. Collectors are willing to pay top dollar for these pennies because of their scarcity in such perfect condition as well as the thrill of owning a unique piece of history. Now you're probably wondering, do I have a million dollar 1964 D penny sitting in my collection? The first step is to check the condition. If your coin looks pristine, consider getting it graded by a professional grading service like PCGS or NGC. Graded coins are more attractive to collectors and auction houses, and the right grade could skyrocket its value. Even if your coin doesn't have an error, a high-grade 1964D penny could still be worth thousands. So don't count it out. So there you have it, the story of the 1964D Mint Mark Lincoln penny. Who knew that a simple coin from your change could be worth so much? If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to stay updated on more valuable coins you might have hidden away. Asterisk, we have an amazing story to share with you about a humble penny that could be worth millions. That's right, I'm talking about the 1971 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny. So grab your coin collections and let's explore why this little copper coin could make you rich. Before we get into the value, let's take a quick look at the history of the 1971 Lincoln penny. In the early 70s, the U.S. Mint was producing millions of pennies every year and the design of the Lincoln cent had already been in place for over six decades. But here's where things get interesting. 1,971 pennies produced in Philadelphia had no mint mark. That's typical for coins minted in Philly, 
but not all 1971 pennies are created equal. The 1971 penny follows the classic Lincoln design, first introduced by Victor David Brenner in 1909, featuring Abraham Lincoln's profile on the front and the Lincoln Memorial on the reverse. Now, if you happen to find a 1971 penny without any mint mark, it means it was minted in Philadelphia, as no mint mark was added to coins produced there. But not all 1971 no mint mark pennies are valuable. The trick is finding one that's in exceptional condition. A regular worn down 1971 penny? It's still worth one cent. But if your coin is in pristine condition, especially if it's been professionally graded, you could be sitting on a fortune. Now let's talk about value. A regular 1971 no mint mark penny in circulated condition won't get you much more than face value. But, asterisk and here's the big news asterisk, a 1971 penny in mint condition can be worth a small fortune. Pennies graded by experts as MS-65, MS-66, or higher can go for thousands of dollars at auction. And, in some cases, they've been sold for millions. These high-grade 1971 no-mint mark pennies are rare because finding a coin that has been preserved without any wear, damage, or discoloration for over 50 years is incredibly difficult. If your penny looks shiny and nearly perfect, it might be worth getting it graded by a professional service like PCGS or NGC. You'd be surprised how much a tiny flaw can impact the value. Just recently, a near-perfect 1971 no-mint Mark Lincoln penny sold for over a million dollars at auction. This shows how even common-looking pennies can turn out to be hidden treasures. So, check your change, check your collection, because you might be holding on to one of the most valuable coins ever. To recap, here's what you need to look for if you want to know if your 1971 penny could be worth millions no mint mark, Philadelphia mint, mint state condition, nowhere, scratches, or discoloration, professional grading by a service like PCGS or NGC remember, the better the condition, the more valuable it becomes. That's it for today's video, folks. Who knew a simple 1971 penny could hold so much value? Make sure to go through your piggy banks, old drawers, and coin collections, you might just hit the jackpot. If you enjoyed this video and want to learn more about rare and valuable coins, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. Who knows? The next coin we cover might just be hiding in your pocket. We're talking about a simple penny. Yes, a 1965 no mint Mark Lincoln penny that could be worth millions of dollars. But how did this ordinary looking penny become one of the most valuable coins in the world? Today, we'll dive into its history, the unique characteristics that make it so special, and of course, its incredible value. Let's get started. In the mid 1960s, the US mint was under pressure. There was a massive coin shortage due to the rising demand for coins partly fueled by the coin-collecting craze at the time. To address this, the Mint made a few big changes in 1965. First, the Mint decided to stop placing Mint marks on coins from 1965 to 1967 to discourage collectors from hoarding newly minted coins. That's why you won't find a D4 Denver or an S4 San Francisco on this penny. So, what makes the 1965 penny stand out from the billions of other pennies minted that year? Firstly, it's important to note that while this penny looks similar to others, collectors search for specific features. Keep an eye out for coins in mint condition, ones that haven't been circulated much. These coins can be graded by professionals, and the higher the grade, the more valuable the coin. Now, here's where it gets really interesting. Some of the most valuable 1965 pennies are those with errors, such as double strikes, off-center strikes, or even coins struck on the wrong planchet. These rare errors make the coin a target for collectors. Okay, now for the big question. How can a penny from 1965 be worth millions of dollars? Well, it all comes down to rarity, condition, and collector demand. A regular 1965 penny may only be worth a few cents, but an uncirculated penny in pristine condition with no mint mark can fetch upwards of $1.6 million at auction depending on its grade and any error it might have. And that's right, an error penny with certain unique features has sold for over a million dollars. 
It's these rare finds that collectors dream of. Now, before you start digging through your pocket change or that jar of old pennies, here's how you can tell if you've got a winner. First, look for any errors we mentioned earlier, double dies, off-center strikes, or even coins that feel slightly different in weight, which could mean they were struck on the wrong planchet. Next, check the overall condition. Is the penny shiny, with no scratches or wear marks? The better the condition, the more valuable it could be. Lastly, consider getting your penny graded by a professional coin grading service. This can significantly boost its value if it's in exceptional condition. So there you have it, folks. The fascinating story of how a 1965 no mint Mark Lincoln penny could make you a millionaire. Be sure to check your change and see if you're sitting on a hidden fortune. Did you know that a penny in your pocket might be worth millions of dollars? Yes, you heard that right. In today's video, we're diving into the fascinating world of coin collecting and exploring the history, value, and potential fortune behind the 1995 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. 1995 No Mint Mark Lincoln Penny. Could you have a fortune in your pocket? Let's take a quick trip down memory lane. The Lincoln Penny has been around since 1909, commemorating the 100th anniversary of Abraham Lincoln's birth. The 1995 penny is part of this long lineage. But what makes the 1995 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny so special? 1995 was a pretty normal year for the U.S. Mint. Millions of Lincoln pennies were struck, especially in Philadelphia, which didn't include a mint mark on its coins. That's why there's no mint mark on this penny, and it's often referred to as the 1995 No Mint Mark penny. But what sets this coin apart from the rest? One particular feature makes it stand out. In 1995, a small error occurred during the minting process, leading to the creation of what's known as the double die variety of this penny. This means certain letters, particularly on the word liberty and the phrase in God we trust, appear doubled or overlapped due to a misalignment. Collectors love these types of errors. A double die coin, especially from a year like 1995, can drastically increase the value. But even if your 1995 no mint mark penny doesn't have the doubling, some coins have still fetched high prices due to their pristine condition. Now let's talk numbers. What is this coin worth? A regular 1995 no mint mark penny might only be worth its face value, just one cent. However, if you have a double die variety or a coin in exceptional condition, the value skyrockets. Pennies in a high grade like those certified by professional grading services, have sold for hundreds or even thousands of dollars. In fact, some flawless examples of the 1995 penny have reached prices of up to $4,000 at auction. And the double-die version? That could be worth even more, sometimes reaching tens of thousands of dollars depending on its grade. For a penny, that's an incredible return on investment. But could your 1995 penny really be worth millions? The truth is, while number 1995 Lincoln penny has reached that price tag just yet, the world of coin collecting is unpredictable. Coins that were once thought to be worth little have suddenly surged in value as demand grows. It's not impossible for rare era coins or exceptionally high-grade pennies to fetch a massive price at a future auction. Who knows? If you have a rare penny, or a coin in absolutely perfect condition, you might just hit the jackpot one day. So, how do you know if you're holding a valuable penny? First, inspect your 1995 penny for any signs of doubling, especially on the letters. Even if you don't see a doubling error, check the overall condition of the coin. The fewer scratches and imperfections, the better. If you think you've got a special coin, consider having it graded by a professional service. Grading companies like PCGS or NGC will assess the condition and certify its value, which is key for serious collectors. So, there you have it. The 1995 No Mint Mark Lincoln penny may seem ordinary at first glance, but it could be worth much more than you think. Have you checked your coins recently? You might be sitting on a small fortune. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell for more fascinating coin stories and potential treasures you might have hiding at home. We're talking about something truly special, the 2002 D-Mint Mark Lincoln 1-Cent Penny. 
Believe it or not, this little coin might just be worth a fortune. We're talking millions of dollars. So, stick around as we uncover its history, value, and the secret behind its massive worth. At first glance, the 2002 D penny looks like any other one-cent coin. It features Abraham Lincoln's famous profile on the front, while the reverse side shows the iconic Lincoln Memorial, a design we've seen for decades. But there's so much more to this little coin than meets the eye. Let's take a quick trip back in time. In 2002, the Denver Mint struck over 3.4 billion of these pennies. That's right, billions! But despite the massive numbers, certain rare versions of the 2002 D penny have caught the attention of collectors, pushing their value into the millions. The key here is the condition, rarity, and errors that can make these coins so valuable. The first thing to understand is the grading system for coins. For a 2002 D Lincoln penny, the mint condition or MS, mint state, rating is what can skyrocket its value. A penny graded at MS 68 or higher is extremely rare. The finest known examples are flawless, free from scratches, wear, or any signs of handling. And those are the coins that auction for insane prices. We're talking over a million dollars. But that's not all. Error coins are where things get really interesting. Some 2002 D pennies were struck with minting errors like double dies, off-center strikes, or even die cracks. These mistakes turn ordinary pennies into highly sought-after collectibles. If you happen to come across one of these error coins in your change, you could be holding on to a jackpot. In recent years, rare error pennies and high-grade examples of the 2002 D. Lincoln penny have sold for staggering amounts at auctions. In fact, one near-perfect coin sold for millions, making it one of the most valuable modern pennies ever found. Now you might be thinking, how can a penny be worth millions? Well, it all comes down to rarity. Even though millions of 2002 D pennies were made, finding one in pristine condition or with a significant mint error is like finding a needle in a haystack. Collectors and investors are willing to pay top dollar to own a piece of American numismatic history. So, how do you know if your 2002 D penny is valuable? Here are a few quick tips. First, check the coin's condition. The fewer scratches and blemishes, the better. Next, examine the coin closely for any unusual features, like doubling of the letters or an off-center strike. Finally, consider getting your penny graded by a professional coin grading service like PCGS or NGC. Grading services can help you determine the exact value of your coin, and if it's a high-grade or error penny, you might just have a coin that's worth a life-changing amount of money. So, go ahead, grab your coin jars and start searching through those pennies. Who knows, you might have a 2002 D. Lincoln penny that's worth millions sitting right under your nose. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss our next episode on rare and valuable coins. And let us know in the comments, have you ever found a rare penny in your collection? We're diving deep into the history, value, and why some 1973 D. Mint Mark Lincoln pennies have become incredibly valuable. So, if you're a coin collector, or just curious about rare coins, stay tuned, because you might just have one of these treasures in your pocket. First, let's take a look at the history of the Lincoln penny. The Lincoln cent was first introduced in 1909, honoring the 100th anniversary of President Abraham Lincoln's birth. This iconic design by Victor D., Brenner has stood the test of time, with Lincoln's profile remaining on the penny for over a century. I in 1973, the Denver Mint produced millions of these pennies, easily recognized by the small D mint mark beneath the date. But what makes some of these 1973 D pennies worth far more than their face value? Let's find out. The 1973 D penny is part of the Lincoln Memorial Cent series which was minted between 1959 and 2008. On the front of the penny, we have the familiar bust of Abraham Lincoln, and on the reverse side, the Lincoln Memorial. If you look closely under the date, you'll see the D mint mark, indicating it was minted in Denver. But here's where things get interesting. While most of these pennies are worth only a penny, some coins have unique characteristics that send their value skyrocketing into the millions. Let's take a look at what makes these coins so special. 
So, what makes a 1973 D penny worth millions? The key lies in rare minting errors and high grade conditions. Coins that were struck with errors, like double die obverse or off center strikes, can fetch incredible prices at auction. These errors occurred during the minting process, making them highly sought after by collectors. Additionally, pennies in pristine, uncirculated condition, with perfect or near perfect grading, are extremely valuable. Coins that score an MS65 or higher from grading services like PCGS or NGC can sell for thousands, or even millions, depending on the rarity of the error and the coin's condition. In fact, some 1973 D pennies have already made headlines at auction. A recent sale saw one in near perfect condition sell for over $1 million. These sales prove that even modern pennies can carry immense value especially when they are rare or exhibit unusual features. Now you're probably wondering, how can I tell if my 1973 D penny is worth millions? Here are some tips. 1. Use a magnifying glass to examine your coin closely. Look for doubled letters, numbers, or off-center designs. 2. The better the condition, the higher the value. A penny with no scratches, nicks, or wear could be highly valuable. Three. If you think you have something special, send your penny to a professional grading service like PCGS or NGC. A high-grade penny is your ticket to those million-dollar auctions. As collectors' interest continues to grow and more rare errors are discovered, the value of the 1973 D. Lincoln penny is expected to rise even further. If you come across one, it's worth taking a closer look, because you never know, you could be holding onto a fortune in your hands. Who knew that something as simple as a penny could be worth millions? The 1973 D. Lincoln penny is just one example of how history, rarity, and condition can turn a common coin into a collector's dream. Make sure to check your change, because the next big discovery could be in your pocket right now. If you enjoyed this video and want to learn more about valuable coins, don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more fascinating stories about rare coins that could make you rich.